All right, guys, I'm back. I see the little bounty icon on the minimap, and now the little cloud on the minimap, indicating he's in this general vicinity, so... We need to keep our eyes peeled for this fella. You could be anywhere. Here in Saltwater Strand, or whatever this was called. Locate Mark Johnson, he is wanted alive. We do need to remember that. So we're going to want to lasso him. Rather than, of course, you know, hack and kill him, so... I still have the bounty waypoint on the minimum. I think my horse is spooked from, like, maybe a it's snake or something right, like that. <laughs> Looks like a structure up there. That might actually be where he's hanging out. I mean, I, I'm going to get my lasso out just in case I find him immediately, and I just... Yeah, this is definitely some sort of fortification or something. What is this? Is he hanging out here? We ain't going till you get. Uh oh. There he is. There he is. I see a couple You're fellers. Here for your bounty. Oh, cop to mama, boy. Don't shoot. I'm unarmed. We knew you was coming. Whoops. Leave my daddy alone, Billy. Leave it. I should have. Yeah, you know what? Can I listen to him now? Oh Lord. I don't want to high time him. I, I want to hear what he has to say. Don't hurt him, mister. Do you have to do this I don't like board? this. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. What is this about? Got you now. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god, it's so hilarious. Mama, he, he's hurting him. I just wanted to say goodbye. Boy, you're the man now. You can't be soft no more. Rest in peace. Well, we'll loot him real quick, too. Da -ba -da -ba 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 hey, you don't mind, do you? What do you guys have to say about it, huh? Yep. Can I loot his horse, too? Now, let me loot his horse. Wow, this is the first time. Man. Yeah, you know what? They knew. They knew he had a bounty. Pick him up. He. I think this guy was a train robber. I think it was, right? So I'm like, they knew. This guy is, uh, he's trouble. Quit that talk. Just be strong, boy. And now he's, uh, making his son the man in the house. Yep. Well... Let's go for a ride. You wanted a life, so hey, you know, that's a good thing for you, at least. Yeah, you're not gonna heck and die in the hands of me, at least. You're gonna die in the hands of the law, if anything happens, right? But, you know, who knows? Maybe you're gonna get out of jail when you're like a billion years old or something like that. Who knows? But anyways, gotta head back to Rhodes and drop this guy off. He heckin' lost his hat and he's got his bolt spot right there. Yep, that's gotta be embarrassing. <laughs> Alright. Oh, oh, what? Did he just escape? That son of a bitch! Did he just escape? Oh, he did! Oh my god! I'm back! Whoa! He... He knew! He was prepared! He probably had a knife on him or something! Oh no, you don't! Damn you! Yeah, get back over here, Ada. Yeah, hog time again. And now, mister! I'll do these tighter this time! Oh yeah. How's that? Guess I had it loose on him, huh? You're coming with me! This guy like Houdini. I don't even know if Houdini was like a meme at this point in time. Maybe is this actually Houdini? Is this a Houdini reveal? What was the point in all that? Could have got your neck broke prematurely. No more games, all right? Yeah, hopefully. I'm like that's that's the funny thing about stowing people on the back of the and hecking animals too on the back of the horse. You th it physically looks like you you know you're rocking back and forth constantly. I'm surprised it didn't happen any sooner. You know them falling off like that. Sheesh. What? Just. You're real quiet back there. Most captured men, they beg or they cry or they rail against fate. I've got nothing to say to you. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I love whenever people just Hold say, on. okay. Won't be long till we're in roads. We're basically in roads now. Yep. But now that, uh, you know, the whole Dutch and Gray and Braithwaite meme is gone, I guess we could just use guns and roads. This is roads. You're almost shot of me. Yep. I'm ready. I hope they make it quick. Sheesh. Yeah, we can use guns here, no problem, I guess, yeah. Because we're not, like, in cahoots with the sheriff anymore. But anyways, speaking of the sheriff, let's go drop this fella off at the sheriff. Let's go actually hitch up our horse, too. I could just say Great Scott. Is that heckin'... Oh, jeez. Uh, remove... There you go. Remove Mark Johnson. <laughs> I don't know if that was the heckin' the doc from Back to the Future that just said that. Sheesh. Back in 1880. Five or well, I don't remember the exact date that he went. Whatever, spoiling thirty-year-old movies. Found this feller on a small holding. Name's Mark Johnson. You can only run so long, son. There's your cell. You're lucky it's not a grave. I was out in the bayou. Wasn't hurting no one. Your past catches up with you. Yep. Put him in the cell. What about the guy with the top hat? Is he still here? No, he's gone. Okay. Well, 
Guess uh, that guy got us got released. Well, I'll take my twenty-five buckaroos now. Yep. Hello, mister. Hello there, Mister. <laughs> Shouldn't that be super easy to escape from with that heckin' lever, like right, like right there? Sheesh. Anyways, let's go pick up our twenty-five buckaroos. That's the price for Johnson. I didn't take it. Someone else would have. Yep. There you go, money clip. You tell yourself that, bounty hunter. You ain't whiter than white. I hope your past catches up with you. I swear I'm a good man now, Sheriff. I got a son. You'll find redemption in a chain gang or on the end of a rope. That's all. Sheesh. We'll be offering a price on another outlaw very soon. Check the station presently. All right, well, I guess I'm like, I remember when we first came to the Rhodes, I was like, oh, is there really no bounties here? But I guess after the whole altercation here at Rhodes, I guess now we could finally do the bounties. And it seems like usually in these towns, there's like two bounties. So, of course, we just did the first one. So there's probably going to be another one here, like you just said, very soon. So uh, maybe we'll want to go tune in. I don't know, maybe it's over there right now. Might want to go check. It's probably over there. If not, we could at least go get the... Uh, the, the, the station wagon or the wagon robbery meme and go do that one instead if if not. Wait, anyways, I probably should have brought my. Can I, can I bring my horse over here? Is he going to come over here? I think so, right? Yeah, he's coming. I, I can see him in the back. Yeah, see, look at that. So it, I guess it doesn't matter if he's hitched up or not. He, he should still be able to come to me. I don't know why I wasn't teleporting me whenever I was on the train all that time ago, though. Huh. Well, anyways, let's go in here and let's go talk to Alden or whatever that guy's name was. Oh, gracious. What does it happen every time? I guess because I'm sprinting in the air. <laughs> I was just ram open the door like I'm heckin' breaking into someone or some place. Sheesh. Hold on. I'll be right there. All right, Alden. Oh, so, oh yeah, we have a dinosaur bone thing. Yeah, let's go send that. All right. What would you like to send? Ah, oh, good to see you. Let me write down the name of that, uh, tailor for you. Yes, I need a new tailor, yes. Coach property for $2. Well, quite enough of your kind here. So, what are we looking at? Passenger's a wealthy merchant. Always travels with a lot of cash on him. Details on the note. Okay. Good seeing you, Alden. And you, my friend. And you. Mm-hmm. I will be sure to go check out this tailor. This tailor that you, Alden, are recommending to me. Some random... Citizen. Bye. Yes. <laughs> Being so heckin' casual about everything, sheesh. Alright, also... Very wealthy guy with cash on him. I like the sound of that. I guess we're going to have to look at the details of this here on this note. And actually, uh, let's see. Open up the satchel. And let's read Scarlet Meadow something. And read. Coach robbery tip. Road southwest of Bulger Glade. Look at look for a carriage coming from the south. Passenger is a wealthy merchant. Probably keeps his cash hidden, so might need some persuasion. XXXX. Tentacion. <laughs> Anyways, Bulgar Glade. I don't know where that is, but they're going to be coming from the south. Okay, it's already marked on the minimap. Okay, that's good. Because I don't know where that is. Anyways, I guess we'll go do this mission real quick, you guys. And then I guess... Oh, there it is right there. So it's going to be coming from the south. And it's actually really close by. So, hey. And remember, we can actually go to Strawberry and do these same missions. Uh, except because, you know, there's no train station over in Strawberry. We need to go to the station wagon guy and get uh, missions from him. But anyways, uh, I don't know. It, it seems like this place might be far enough away where I need to pause the recording, so I'm just going to do that exact thing, and I'll see you guys here in a bit, and we can actually do this little station wagon robbery meme, so I'll see you guys here in just a bit. Alright guys, I'm back. I'm already seeing a little splotch on the minimap, so that's great. They're going to be coming from the south, so wait for the stagecoach to arrive, so they're going to be coming from that way. And just go right there to get rid of the waypoint, so. There we go. So they're going to need some persuasion. It's not like a uh, heckin' other RPGs out there where you level certain stats like speech and you'll be able to persuade him or anything like that. <laughs> so uh, I suppose I'll just hitch my horse, force the stagecoach to stop. So, I don't know. I, I guess I just could park my horse in the middle of the road. I don't know if that, that'll work. Hey, hey! There we go. Yep. I'm like, they just go around me, but like, whatever. I did. <laughs> These damn roads are hell on my back. Could you please control your horse? I'm taking us as gently as I, I can, sir. Hey there, yourself. 
Hey, stop the coach! Ignore him. Keep moving. Whoa. Hey. Hey. Hey, you. Uh-oh. I don't want to have to, you know, get violent with this guy like, uh... Oh my god! Oh my god! I'm dead. I'm dead. It just ran over my head. Oh my god. Hurry on! Uh-oh. Okay, I guess I'm going to get my guns out, huh? Alright, driver. Hey. You see this? You see this? Oh my god. I'm going to have to heck in. Faster, damn it! Faster! We've got a madman after us! Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Come on! Where's my horse? It needs to come up. And... There he goes. Get on the horse now. Alright, I guess we are going to have to chase after these guys. Man, they literally ran over my heckin' neck there. I don't know how I'm still alive, but I am. Sheesh. <laughs> Alright, let's get our, uh, let's get our shoddy out so we can be super duper brutal. I do know the semi-auto is probably the best in terms of all the shoddies we've got, so... Let's chase this feller. Maybe it's you he's after. Faster! Go on! Can't go any faster! I'm right here, hey dude! Oh my god! Oh my god! We got ran over again! Oh, jeez. <laughs> oh my god, I can't do it. I can't even aim my weapon for some reason. I don't know why I can't aim my weapon. Oh my god, they're in they're in town now. Holy heck. How am I supposed to stop these guys, like, non-violently? Because he, he just, he just, just put our guns up for right now. What? I failed? It reached, ro oh yeah, oh, okay, uh, try a checkpoint. Golly. How am I supposed to stop? I, I don't want to have to shoot the guy, but I might have to. Pretty requires some persuasion. You guys know what uh, that one guy said. Yep. In terms of, you know, but didn't we, yeah, we, I'm like, we did, yeah, we did use our guns on the second one, didn't we? The second uh, stagecoach robbery, right? So I suppose we just kind of stay in the middle of this road, kind of reminiscent of that train robbery we did where we just had the heckin' oil wagon in the middle of the, I don't know, Lancaster. There we go. Yep. But I'm going to use my shoddy so we can be super violent about it. Sheesh. <laughs> but he should be coming through any moment now. Oh, yep, there they are right there. Force the stagecoach to drive. I don't know. I guess I could heck and shoot the horse or something like that, right? I'm like, that's one way to force it to stop. Golly. I put my guns up for right now, though. I don't know. I'm like, whenever I do have my guns out, I'm not able to shoot for whatever reason. Let me let me call out to the fella, though, and be like, hey, stop your horse. Oh. Okay, it is just one horse. So it was going to be kind of easy. Damn roads are hell on my back. Could you please control your horse? The I'm taking us as gently. Hey, stop the coach! Ignore him. Keep moving. Uh oh. Hey, you're gonna need to move out of the way. Hey there, Mister. Aim the weapon. Kill the heckin'. Oh, jeez. Oh my God! Why can't I? Come on, yeah. Oh, there you go. Stop that. God. We're being oh, darn damnation. Sheesh! Stop the passenger. Stop him. Track fleeing people with that. I kind of want to just lasso them. <laughs> hey there, mister. I'm like, I don't want to have to kill these guys if I don't have to, but then again, I just heckin' killed a gigantic oh, heckin' right horse. There. Golly! Alright, well, the driver's getting away, but this guy, I'm like, he, he, this guy had his back hurting from the road, so I only assume he can get so far. There we go. Hey there, mister. Give me your money. <laughs> I die, I'm hated. I know about the money. Hand it over. I don't know what you're talking about. Loot them while we're at it and go heckin'. Okay, okay, stop! I'll tell you. There's a lockbox hidden under the coat. The money's in there. Better not be lying to me. <sighs> nice, I like the sound of that. Golly, that- I'm not! I swear! Is that really what we had to do? Heck and kill the- either kill the horse or kill the- uh, the, the driver or maybe both? I don't know. But then again, yeah, didn't want to actually kill this guy though, that's why I lassoed him. But I'm going to bring him back. Unfortunately, he's not getting anywhere without his heckin' horse alive. <laughs> so who knows, I guess we can go kidnap this guy and go throw him in the swamp or something like that if we really want to. But for right now, I'm just keep this guy nearby. And if he's if he's lying, then hey, he's dead. Like mean, he's going to be dead later either way, but whatever. Pull out. Lock box. Did he, is he escaping? No, he's, he's still there. Where is this? Is it hidden under the... Oh, yep. Oh, hey! I like the sound of that. Or, the sight of that. Anyways, open up the lockbox. Loot the lockbox. Whoa, bill stack don't mind if I do. How much is that? 20 to- that's it? That's nothing. Mission complete coach robbery? That is absolutely and utterly nothing. Alright, well, ah, whatever. I'll let this guy live. His horse right there probably costs way more than next. <laughs> $25. Sheesh. Alright, cut free. 
I don't know where your driver is, but hey, it's not my problem anymore, eh? Hey, there you go there, sure. Yeah, you don't fight me. I know you're going to try and do it, but whatever. Alright, well, we had one casualty during this. I don't know if killing the horse was the best idea or killing the driver was, but whatever. Either way, that guy's hopefully not going to be telling on us, but $25 right there, hey, don't mind if I do. Let's go talk to this guy and be all heckin' casual about it, be like, hey there, mister. Hey there! Hopefully he's not going to associate that with me, right? Jeez. <laughs> ah, $25. Ah, it was, was kind of a fun little side thing, right? Not not too big of a deal. Oh, man. Leopold. Oh. I think like we are, like, right next to the... I guess we could do these. Get these uh, Leopold Shrouds. <sighs> then again, we just did a sad... Uh, what was his name? Thomas Downs thing? He died. I guess we're going to be continuing with more of the- Oh, jeez. Oh my god. I almost just ran into a truck. Why does that keep happening? Golly. You know, for me not playing- I was about to say this during the, uh, the, the gun shooting gallery thing with that Mexican guy, you guys remember? But for me not playing for like five fucking weeks, I'm not as rusty as I was anticipated when I was like, golly. Hey there, Charles. It's me. Welcome back, Arthur. Yep. But I, I thought I'd be way more rusty. I, I, I'd miss like every shot or anything like that. Or, oh my god, what in the- What? Did you guys see that? There's an eagle, like, floating above us. Where is it now? Oh, there it is. It, it. Owl. Oh, it's an owl. Shoot it! Oof. <laughs> Go get it! It's like an owl. I thought it looked like it was just floating above us five seconds. You rewind the video in, like, 20 seconds. Anyways, we got ourselves a heckin' owl. Didn't even know that was a thing we could hunt. Uh, but I'm like, it is nighttime now. It's like Pluck the owl. There we go. Jeez, that thing's huge. Great horned owl. Yeah, pluck those feathers out. Hey, ooh. Yeah, go take its carcass. Go give it to... The, uh, there you go. Oh, yeah, it's a two-star. Uh, it, was, it was probably two-star. I did I did shoot it with a Lancaster Repeater. So, I don't know if we lost any rating from using the Lancaster Repeater, but I assume not. I think they always go to one-star whenever you use the wrong weapon. Either way! Oh, man, there's a question mark on Sadie Adler. Oh, yeah, yeah, we have the harmonica for her. Yeah, we want to want to give that to her. Hey there, Mr. Pearson. Let's go give the harmonica back to her while we're in the area. And then go get the Leopold Strauss meme. So, let's go donate this. Uh, yes, donate. Oh yeah, I've got a lot of stuff. Sheesh. Gamey, bird meat, sure, well, I don't care. Not the best quality, but some seasoning will hide it. I don't care. Owl feather and good owl carcass. Yep. There you go for appropriations. And I think we're good. I don't want to a raven feather. I think I need these things for crafting certain things, so I don't want I don't want to use them if I don't need to, you know? Big game meat? Sure, donate for provisions. We've got tons of that stuff. Getting low. Low? Ah, yeah, we are white. Eh, I don't know how we're not yellow on food yet for whatever reason, but whatever. Anyways, Sadie Adler. Adler. Sadie Adler. Give request. Here. I got a hold of a harmonica for you. I look forward to hearing you play it. The only audience I ever had was my husband, and I'm going to keep it that way. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Fair enough. But thank you, Arthur. This is real kind of you. You know whose harmonica that was? That's right. The world famous shooter Emmett Granger, yep. And I've still got the horse stimulant in my room that's blinking on the minimap for whatever reason. But anyways, so let's go talk to Leopold Strauss. What he's like, does he have his own like cabin or something? It looks like he does. Yeah, he's got like his own personal cabin over here. What in the world? I didn't even notice this was a thing, but I guess it is. Sheesh. Look at this guy. Fancy dancy. Is he outside? Oh yeah, he is. There he is right there. Hey there, mister. Shroush. Oh, what in the world? Can I climb up this? Talk to him. I can't... Oh, jeez. Hey there. I can't... I... Oh my god, I need to get up there somehow. Get up there. There you go, Arthur. Nice. Alright. Hey there, Shroush. Still working, Mr. Strauss. What you been up to? Trying to wrap up our accounts before we leave, Mr. Morgan. So you'll be joining us in Tahiti? I uh, rather fancied Australia. A similar kind of people to us. Lots of opportunity. That tells me we're going to be ranchers. Perhaps, but um, so far we have not raised many cattle. No. So, Mr. Morgan, will you help me finalize our business here? <coughs> this is filthy work. We'll need money in Australia. Uh, for cattle and feed, I mean. Why flinch now? You never have done before. I don't know. Well, here they are. 
Some fishermen by the name of Davison, Algy Davison, living in a place called Catfish Jackson near Scarlet Meadows. A fisherman. And that's it. They're a union built on that, you know. Uh, okay. Catfish Jackson again. He's like right here. Are we going to get... I don't remember the name of the guy, though. I thought the name of the guy was Catfish Jackson. Is there a different guy living in that house now? I don't know. Anyways, I'm like, we did rob them, like, pretty recently, so... Not only are we robbing them, but we're getting our heckin' loan back. Oh, and by the way, you guys, we rob... I'm, I'm the same guy that robbed you, like, two weeks ago, and now I'm here for my heckin' loan money. Hey, you know, sheesh. You know that money I stole from you, like, two weeks ago? Yeah, that's separate, so... Golly, we're such absolute and utter savages. Our Arthur does uh, have like a bit of a cough kind of going on right now. I wonder if I could take something to kind of figure. Oh, hold on, how are my cores going? Eh. Yeah, I don't know if I need to take some sort of medicine to kind of combat that or anything like that. But either way, there you go. Oh wait, time. Oh god, I, I took a special. Ah, uh, whatever. I took a specialized big game meat right there. But whatever, not that big of a deal. We still got our cores up. So that's good. Well, anyways, let's just go get on our horse and. Go pay a visit. I guess Catfish Jackson is the name of the house or the home of the uh, name of the home or whatever. So that guy that we robbed, I guess he's not Catfish Jackson. Yeah. I have no idea how that goes. Either way, how far away is that? Yeah, that's that's still pretty close by. It's still Al Algy Davison. I guess that's the name of the guy then, huh? But what in the world is the name Catfish? Where does that come from? I don't know. Who, well, anyways? I don't know if I need to pause the recording. Because this is relatively close by, but I may need to. Oh, whoa. What is this? What is this light? Oh, it just went out. Who's that? Paul Revere? Hey, who are you, mister? What in the world? Oh, is that, uh, is that Lenny? No. Stranger. Can you hold up a second? Ah, oh, second thoughts. Stay right there. Run back to mama. At least she loves you. <laughs> but even she knows you're pathetic. This guy does not care. Golly. Jumped on a horse. <laughs> oh, man. I don't know why I'm being so mean to get that guy. Golly. I just saw his, like, lantern out or something like that. And he's running. I don't know what in the world that guy's running all about, but whatever. But anyways, let's keep on heading this general direction towards Caffeine Jackson. Which I guess is just the name of the house, like I said. But... I don't know if I need the pause the recording because we're probably like right there anyways, especially thanks to our dick fest Arabian horse. Whoa! Here comes the big bastard. Get in position. Uh oh. Yeah. Uh oh, uh oh. There's some fellers here. I hear some fellers. Ah. Oh my god. Oh Jesus, the people from Shady Bell. We need to get them. Oh my god. Why can't I? Oh my god. I literally just said, oh yeah, I'm, I'm not even doing that. Oh my god, why can't I mark that guy? There we go. Hit these guys, how are they missing like every shot on me? I'm like stationary, golly. Oh, I'm dead, oh my god. Jeez, I don't know why I wasn't able to mark that guy for like, that basically the entire time right there, sheesh. All right, well we just lost some money. We have like 2,000, we probably just lost like $200 or something crazy just because we died right there, golly. More of these Lamoran Raiders upset a, uh, oh my god, a heckin' hundred, and we're still over $2,000 total, golly. Like, we have insane amounts of money these days, you guys. Sheesh, I don't even know that's $100 anymore. Golly. So that's why I'm over here, like, doing spending sprees, so we can at least, you know, get use out of our money before something like that happens and we end up losing it, you know? But anyways, we're here at Catfish Jackson's house. Whatever. It's, I don't even know what to call this anymore. Anyway, search the home for the debt. Let's get our... Oh, jeez, I don't even have my shotgun out. I want to have my shotgun out just to be intimidating as butt. So, I know I could... Right, like right there, you can see draw a Lancaster repeater from horse. I don't even have to open up the menu. I know that, but like, I also want to get my other one. My, let's see, semi auto shotgun. Yep. So there you go. That way we've got some big guns ready to go. If I need to use them, that is. Open up! Yep. Time for money, hater. Give me your money. We'll search this. Oh yeah, their shotgun's gone. Yeah, I remember I took that a while ago. They sleep. Let's go to the boys' room. Time for money. Give me your money. Oh wait. Oh wait, hold on. There's the other card. It's still there. The other six. Oh wait, no, that's the. Wait, that's the one with the horse. How do you get that one back? 
I don't know. Oh man, why does the boy have heckin' Kentucky bourbon in his room? I don't know, he might be of age, you never know. Either way, I'm taking that, you know. Anyways, I guess we go to the other room and see uh, if anyone's inside up, you know, sleeping. There's literally no one here, what in the world? Uh, okay. Really? I think there'd be people here, but I guess... Okay, this is the kitchen. Cupboards. Fireplace is on. I'm not able to... Did I just write something down? I think I did. I just heard, like, write on paper noises. Can I do anything about this? I don't think I can. I think I already got the money from the chimney, so I can't do anything there. Cabinets are a, uh... Oh, what the wrong Gin. I can't take it. Yeah. Nothing back there. Yeah, you can see all the cabinets and all the drawers and stuff are still open from last time, so... Huh, I don't know where I'm going to get my money. Oh, wait. There's some ammunition, some other random track, gin, short... Oh, wait, that's biscuits, yeah. I don't know how I'm going to get my money. So I go over here, then, huh? Maybe somewhere out back? I don't know. Can't carry any more of this item, I don't even know what it is. It's, uh, crackers. Okay, whatever. Canned vegetables, can't take that either. Someone's got to do dishes. Not going to be me, I'll tell you that much. Sheesh. <laughs> Guess we'll go to the boys' room. Did I have a bathroom or something like that? I don't think so. Let's see if there's anything here worth. Wow, yep. I guess I'll take that heckin' thing again. What is this? Candy! I remember I was I got sour about taking the candy last time, but I do need heckin' uh, money, so heckin' guess I'll take something of value, but I can't take the candy. I guess I'll take the card again. Yeah, you got you got that cigarette card back, but you know what? I'm taking it again. Sports card number twelve. Put away. And I got some dead eye from that. Sheesh. Is that thing locked? Search wardrobe. Oh, I thought it looked, it looked like it was locked right there, but I guess not. Alright, search drawer. There's something right there. I don't know what that is. I guess I can't grab whatever that is. Okay, whatever. And what am I doing here? Oh yeah, there's a chest here too, yeah. I doubt there's anything in here though. Because I'm alright. Oh yeah. Wait, what was that? Oh, algae's debt. I think that was. Yep, algae's debt money. Oh, I just now noticed algae. Like I can, uh... A-L-G-A-E. <laughs> I like that name. But anyways, what's going on back here? Is there really no one here? Did they just leave? I guess we just collected everything in just one fell swoop, huh? Maybe they're going to be like, Hey, what are you doing in my house? Hey, dude. Let's just get our shoddy out just to be... Oh, this might be their bathroom. Maybe they have an outhouse. Yeah, that makes sense. Forgot that those were a thing. And are still a thing. Hey there, girl. You guys ever heard of a porta potty <laughs> Basically an outhouse on wheels. Yeah. Well, anyways, let's just skiddly nod down and go take this money back to the camp. I'm like, we are like right next to the camp anyway, so hey. Man, look at this picture. This looks fantastic. Like, I was about to say like five years ago, seeing something like this on console would be unbelievable. But literally five years ago, the PS4 came out, right? Sheesh. I don't know. Even 10 years. Golly, 10 years ago was 2009. What in the world? I guess 10 years ago. <laughs> you couldn't imagine something like this on console, but then again, this is technically a second generation PS4 in the form of the PS4 Pro. And then there's still all the Xbox One X. That's slightly one step above the PS4 Pro. Anyways, there's a black X here and canning a dead body. What's happening? Easy now. Whoa. What's oh another oh this is this a oh it looks like it oh huh? Okay, now it looks like we found a serial killer thing. Behold. Sheesh. Yep, yep, strung up and everything just like the first one. Focus on track, stranger. So we're going that way. We got my gun out just in case. Golly. Where'd it go? Oh, jeez, a leg. I guess that's taking me to this heckin' leg. Oh. This goes down here. Wait, it looks like it's just circling back up. Where in the... Huh? Going into this? Goes around. I am not seeing... And it just goes to the leg. It just stops at a heckin' leg. I guess I'm focusing on the track of the dead guy. Oh, gee, oh, there's a heckin' another you-know-what with a you-know-what in its mouth. Yep. Golly. Ugh, I'm making a point with you. Uh. Ugh. <sighs> Another piece to the map or whatever. Oh, jeez. Oh, yeah, don't look at that there on the bottom right corner. Uh, 
put away or flip. You f find. Okay, put that away. Killer clue two piece. That's kind of cool that I mentioned the uh, the serial killer, but and then like an episode or so later we actually find a number two piece. I, I, I kind of want to go look at the thing again. Collect the remaining mystery map piece to uncover the mystery. Okay, so there's one more mystery map piece. Okay, well. Had our horse. Okay, girl, it's okay. I know this is a spooky situation right here. Yep. Open up our satchel real quick though. Killer two. I kind of can I can I put these together? I don't think I can. Killer clue two. Now can I look at killer clue number one? I don't know. Oh, open padlock. Lock breaker used to silently break locks. So I guess I could use that multiple times, huh? Anyways, documents. Notes. Is it? Is it here? No letter. To, no, I'm not reading that. Golly. <laughs> Maps in general. Uh, killer clue. Okay, here's killer clue piece number one. I can barely see that. And flip. Me? And then if we looked at. Killer clue piece number two. Is. It looks like it might be somewhere near, like, the Gray's Farm or the Wraithwaite's Plantation or something like that, you know? Flip that back over. You find me. You find- is that what it says on the back? You find me? I guess. I- I really do need that third piece, though. And I assume the third piece is- Yep. Ah, I don't know. I guess maybe, maybe we'll come across it randomly just like we do with that one. Sheesh. Well, anyways, I do need to come across- go- go back- and where in the world are we? Uh, yeah, we have to go back there, I think, right? Or, I assume we do. What in the world? Is there? Where's the other, uh, oh wait, what is this? Hold on. Charles. Wait, who is this? Oh, is that the artist guy? Oh, it is. The artist's way. Yeah, that guy gave me a demonetizable, uh, painting or something like that. Brother Dorkins. Oh yeah, that's the, the monk guy. Yeah. And then where's this other bounty? Or, uh. What do you call it? I'm not seeing it. I don't know where this other, uh, loan shark thing is. Huh. Well, anyways, I guess I'll just head back to the camp. Kind of this general direction. I guess I'm glad it, it was nighttime right here. And I was able to actually see that light from quite a distance. And I saw the X on the minimap in indicating a dead body. So, lots of situations kind of lining up right there to make sure we saw the heckin'. Oh, is this? No, this is the, yeah, this is the abandoned church. Yeah. I don't know, maybe maybe off camera I'll just kind of investigate around like the Gray's farm and the Braithwaite's farm and see if there's like a... Okay. Oh! Uh-oh. Sure looks about right, I, I, I think. What's this? Oh, oh, geez, they're opening up the safe. Hey, why don't you walk along and forget what you saw? Okay, they're opening up the safe. Okay. So, you know what that means, it's time for me to... Ba -ba -da -ba -ba -da. I'm opening up that safe myself, hey dude, I'm gonna get that money. Well, I saved the money from getting blown to hell at least. For now. <laughs> saved the money from getting blown up from them at least. It's gonna get blown up from me. Properly that is, because I'm gonna be using dynamite in a proper way. So, there we go, dynamite. Golly, we have tons of stuff here, sheesh. Oh wait! There's already dynamite on it. Do I just have to light it up? Ignite the dynamite. Oh, jeez, let's go! Oh! Nice! Nice! <laughs> Alright, let's go see what's inside. Hopefully my horse is okay. Hopefully it was a pretty good safe distance. Oh, yep, yep, look at that. Some money in there. Oh, yeah, there's some dynamite box back there, too. I wonder if we can get some dynamite to kind of make up for the dynamite we just spent. Spend it in your honor, boys. 20 bucks right there, another 20 bucks right there, not bad. Still net loss of like $60 or something like that, right? Sheesh. Can I not get anything in from this? Oh, there's literally a bunch of dynamite right there. Can I not grab that? I can't even grab the heck of dynamite. Golly! Now, can I put dynamite on the dynamite? That's what I want to know. Here we go. Put the di- Oh my god, why can't I- Come on. Ignite the dynamite. I wonder if it can spread. Oh my god! Oh my god, what? That horse just died. <laughs> Jeez! That dynamite explode too? Or is it like glitched? I assume it. Did. Jeez, rest in peace, horse. I can't. I completely forgot about that horse right there, guys. Golly. Whoa. Well, there's a lantern. I guess it worked. <laughs> God, man, that horse got annihilated. 
Rest in absolute I can peace. Oopsie doopsie, right? Vanna Church. Oh yeah, I wonder if there's any more stuff here I could actually loot. There's always people like hanging out inside of here. Uh, and that lockbox right there still, yeah, that one's still already looted. Alright, well, whatever. We got some good money right there. And wasted an extra thing of dynamite for whatever reason, so whatever.